Hey guys, sorry I haven't made a video in a while. My computer has been down and I've been really busy. But um, I figured I'd start it off by showing you guys my blog real quick that I've made. And this will keep you in touch with like all the stuff that I found and all that. I mean, it's pretty obvious, but basically it's going to be with Blackberries, um, Macs, iPods, iPads, that type of stuff, jailbreaks, and things like that. And iPhones and how to unlock, because I'm going to put a post on that after this. So basically um my this video is going to be on how to jailbreak your ipod um ipad or iphone works with all your devices except for the first iphone so um that's the only bad news and you have to have firmware 3.1.2 or higher and um i've heard that um it works better if you're on um firmware 4.0 but like if you're a first generation ipod user you're not going to be able to do that or something like that. But I had no trouble with it on my first generation iPod. And proof that this is first generation, you can see, kind of old, the metal backing, stuff like that. So, yeah, your first generation iPod. So, what you're going to need to do is go to jailbreakme.com. I'll have a link in the description. Um, and if that's not loading or whatever, it's because there's a lot of traffic on the site. Probably, It probably will. And if you can't get on that, then go to jailbreakme.modmyi.com on your, on your iPad. So basically, here's what you're going to do. You're going to go, you see right up there, it says jailbreak me, whatever, okay. So you go get here, and you have an error that says, like, oops, something happened. That's because I already, already downloaded it, but it's going to ask you if you want to jailbreak it. And you're just going to slide across, and you're going to say jailbreak. And basically the thing's going to load and you're just going to wait. It's uh, that simple. You need no computer or anything. Um, if this um, screen doesn't appear, then, or like say like it's stuck, then what you want to do is you're going to just want to reset your device and just hold your um, home screen and your power button down for 10 seconds. So just boom and boom and it'll reset for any device. And um, I don't know, this, this normally takes... Oh yeah, see it's already done. City has been added to the home screen. So it takes like five, like a minute maybe. And then so you got it jailbroken. You go to your home screen. Well, you gotta let it reboot. But proof that this is jailbroken. I mean you see like the new theme that I have with Toy Story. You have Cydia. Cydia and Winterboard. I can open it up if you want. Cydia is opening up. So proof that my iPod's jailbroken. And um, here's my iPad. Slide over, and we got Cydia down here. Let that open up. The problem with this is that it doesn't do landscape. And Cydia on the iPad is kind of a work in progress because everything's been made for the iPhone and iPod Touch. So, um,. It's going to take probably a month for it to really be like efficient on the iPad, like all the apps and themes working on it. Um, but when you get to stage, just click Upgrade Essentials and then Confirm. And since I already did this, it's going to whatever, so I'm not going to do it. All right, so I'm good. And then um, that's basically all you have to do. Go to jailbreakme.com, slide your phone to jailbreak, and then you're good. Um... I'm going to have uh, a link to my blog in the description along with uh, a post on my blog about how to unlock your uh, iPhone 4. So if you want to use it on like a different carrier like T-Mobile, I'm going to show you how to do that. And um, hopefully everything works out for you. And thanks for watching. Please uh, subscribe for future videos on jailbreaking and other, other uh, tech stuff.